Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be trying TikTok acro slash tricks tutorial. I don't really know. But basically, I'm gonna be trying these tutorials from TikTok and seeing if they actually work. I chose three different types of tricks that I wanna try. First is an aerial, which I've gotten it like on and off, so I can do it sometimes, but like not all the times. Like if you tell me to do an aerial right now, I can't do it. So I'm gonna be seeing if this tutorial works. For the second trick I'm gonna be trying is gonna be a helicopter cartwheel. It seems a bit confusing and I've never tried it before, so we'll see if I can do it. And for the last tutorial, I'm gonna be trying how to do a press handstand, which I've tried it before and I couldn't do it, so I was like, okay, this is kinda hard. <laughs> So I'm gonna be seeing if the tutorial helps at all. I'm really excited to see if these actually work and if a lot of them work, which is like only three. If most of them work, I might make a part two and let's get on with the I video. am sick and tired of all these tutorials being like, here's how you do a side aerial. First, just do a cartwheel, then do a one-handed cartwheel, and then you have your aerial. Because it doesn't work like that. I know that all you try and you just end up like this. Oh, darn it. This is a real side aerial tutorial for people that aren't gymnasts. Anyone can get this. Okay, so instead of approaching it like a cartwheel, we're gonna approach it like a butterfly. Just jump spin like this. Now you're gonna gradually add tilt to it. So like that, add a little more tilt, okay? And then try to get your body flat like this. Okay, and then just stop lifting your chest and drop your head down towards the floor and you have a side aerial. Okay, so first is the aerial, and I have like a sheet with all the instructions on it, so I don't have to keep looking at the video, but you already saw the video since I put it in this video. So first, we have to approach it like a butterfly. So we're just gonna spin around ourselves. Put your legs up, kind of. And then I guess we'll just add more tilt to it. I'm not sure how this is gonna go. I'm just gonna keep on doing it until we can get kind of flat. I'm gonna do it like towards the front so you can see the side angle, but yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna start like dropping my chest a little bit. What was that? Oh my god. I'm putting my hands on the floor. This is not working. Christmas lightings, if you're wondering. We're still in June. I mean, Christmas is like half a year later. I don't know. We're getting back to the level. Yeah, this was not working. Moving on to the second tutorial. Okay, so for the second tutorial, we're gonna be trying a helicopter cartwheel, which I already saw what it looks like. So first, I'm gonna do a front walk over and a cartwheel. So I'm just gonna do that right now. Also, I do a right front walk over and a left cartwheel. So I don't know if that's gonna make a difference. I'm just gonna try both cartwheels. The bar is not gonna look good. Two hands 
stand from a cartwheel. So I think um, after this, I'm gonna rewatch the video to make sure I'm doing the right thing. So like, okay. I have a lot of it. Okay, so I just watched the video and it looked complicated. So I'm gonna try the cartwheel to two handstand first and hold it there for a bit and we'll go on from there. make me no sense. Okay, I'm just gonna do that. So. Was I gonna hit? I don't know, wait, hang on. Just like swing that shoulder. You guys, I did it. So that was 10 minutes exactly. And I just learned a new trick in 10 minutes. Oh my god. Okay. So since that worked, we got one scale down, one left to go, which is the press handstand, which I doubt I'll get. So let's move on to the third tutorial. Final tutorial. First, we're going to start off with 
two sets of 15 of those white thingies. So let's do that. Okay, so we gotta go eat lunch. <laughs> so do this hack after I eat lunch, and I'm gonna redo the two sets of 15. Um, it's going great so far. I'm sweating, as you can probably see. Um, so yeah. So I literally just finished eating lunch, and I was thinking about waiting like an hour or two, but the sun is setting, and if I wait an hour or two, I'm it's literally gonna be dark. So yeah, let's get on with the press handstands. Okay, so I need to redo like, two sets of 15. Wait, did they mean like one on each? Whatever, I'm just gonna do 60. This is like three to five more times and See, I've tried this before. It doesn't work. Like, I'm supposed to go from here to like here. Maybe those exercises help. This is what I mean when I said I can't do a press handstand. Because I can't do a press handstand. This is hard. I also can't go from like like here into a handstand. Like how do you just like lift their feet off of the ground just to like go into the handstand? Like that's how it works. I work on that actually. I saw this tip where you can do it against the wall. So I'm actually gonna try that right now. This is not working. We're like seven minutes into this and I'm already giving up. I'm gonna try each exercise five more times and I'm gonna try it. Well, I probably can't try it because I can't go up onto my feet, but I'm gonna try it and uh, it's not gonna work. Focus. Nice, man. Krispy Kreme. Yeah. How do they do this? This is literally impossible. And so they go on flat. But like, how do you lift your hips up? Like, my arms are not that long. Stand. 
that is it for the third tutorial. That is the end of the video and I hope you guys enjoyed. It was really tiring, but I gave about like each tutorial like about six to 10 minutes, I think, or like six to 12 minutes to like work on it. I only got one skill as you saw, which was the helicopter cartwheel. And I was like already kind of like guessing that I would get it because it seems easier than the other ones. And I've also never tried it before. While the other ones, I've tried it and I couldn't get it. So that's why I was like kind of doubting the tutorials. But I might try some more of these tutorials for part two and maybe the ones that I've never tried before. Because I've definitely seen a lot of tricks that I haven't seen before. So we might try those in part two. So make sure you subscribe so that you can see if part two comes out. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below because that'll mean a lot to me. I'll see you guys next Sunday.